When you look at Mercedes-Benz's expansive global lineup, one out of every three vehicles is an SUV, and one out of every four vehicles is a compact SUV. So if you're just trying to figure out how many SUVs are running around with a three-pointed star on the front, you're not the only one. And this is the latest member of the family. It's the new GLB. Let's check it out. <clears throat> GLA, GLB, GLC, GLE, GLS, G-Wagon, GLC Coupe. Right, there's a lot going on here, right? Now let's figure out where the GLB fits in the SUV lineup for Mercedes. Kind of makes sense the way it works. It's slightly bigger than the baby, the GLA, and just a bit shorter than the GLC. Now size-wise, this is 5.1 inches longer than the GLA and 1.7 inches shorter than the GLC. That all makes sense. The part that doesn't make so much sense is the fact that this guy has three rows of seats and can seat up to seven people. Although the bigger GLC and the even bigger GLE only seat five. Huh? Like a studio apartment back here. Uh, this is the first compact Mercedes SUV to offer seating for seven. Now they put most of the space in between the wheels to accommodate for that. And you'll also notice that the overhangs front and rear are short. Now that's on purpose because the GLB here is supposed to be quite the stud off-road, Mercedes tells us. The very German sounding off-road engineering package adds an additional drive mode for the car, making it better on rougher terrain and also includes features like hill start assist. The car is launching as a GLB 250, so it uses a 221 horsepower four-cylinder engine, and that's currently the only one available. That said, we're pretty sure more are on the way. But let's switch focus back once more to the interior space to mention the crown jewel of every Mercedes product, the MBUX infotainment system, which looks just as good here as it does in all the other Merc mobiles. This is the eighth SUV in the Mercedes-Benz lineup. And just like in any big family, you wonder if this is gonna have trouble competing for attention, but, with its unexpected seating capacity and off-road prowess, it might have what it takes to stand out. 